I speak unto thee this day, and I say, Do not live in fear, but live in faith. For I say that I, the living God, have never called you to live in the fear of carnal men and evil men and threats of the wicked, but I say that I've called you to live in faith and trust and confidence in me. And I say that I've called you to be uplifted, knowing that it is me, the living God, who is the resource, knowing that it is me, the living God, who is the truth, the power, the glory provided. For I say, if you will be living in me each day, then you are brought forth in my way. Now I say, this day you are living in times when the beast is roaring and ranting, but I say it is me, the living God, who will keep the ones who are mine. That is, when a people will continue to believe in me, look to me, and trust me each day, then they are guided in life. And yes, they are given the hope, the strength, the truth, the mercy of who I am, for it is me, the living God, will able to give to them the same. And it is me, the living God, who will direct, correct, and instruct the people who will pay heed unto me. Now I say this day when I, the living God, do give you the way that is truth, the way that is light, and the way that is mercy provided, I say walk in the same. For I say it is me, the living God, who is the way that is righteousness and truth, mercy, strength, and hope provided. And it is me, the living God, who will direct, correct, and guide forth the ones who are cleaving to me. Therefore I say, remember, you are not meant to live in fear, but in faith and trust in confidence in me. For I say that I, the living God, will not leave my people in a place of desolation, but I say that I bring them forth. And I say, when my people are ever trusting in me, then they see my redemptive mercy, they see my goodness and my truth provided unto them. And I say, when a people are ever believing upon me as the one who is able, so are they ever guided by me. And I say, they are given the strength, the truth, and the light day by day. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to be governed by the fears that beset the heathen, not at all. But I say that I call you to remember that it is me that you belong to, it is me that you can believe in and trust. For I say, if you will walk soberly, redeeming the time, then I say you are guided forth in me. And yes, you are given the hope and the peace that only can be found through me. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to reach out to the systems of men, to the arm of flesh, but I say that I call you to keep your confidence in me. That is, ever knowing that I am the one who will give you my goodness day by day. For I say to me, you are directed, corrected, and ever shown the light upon the path. And I say to me, you are given the hope, the strength, the safety that I alone do give to my own. Now I say this day in a wayward, a perverse, a vile generation, there are many who claim they love me, but I say they do not love me. That is, they love this present world, they love the things of the world, and I say they are not loving me. And yes, they are needy of repenting and returning unto me, and it is me, the living God, who will give them the pressure in their lives to do so. But I say that the ones who remain ever faithful and true unto me, I say that I guide them forth. Now I say this day, do not be high-minded, do not be independent, but I say be dependent upon me day by day. And I say, be thankful that I am the one who will ever uplift, guide, and direct you forth. I say, be thankful that I am the one who will give to you the infinite mercy, the truth, the light, and the strength that I provide. For I say, it is me, the living God, who will give you such as you have need of day by day. And I say, if you will keep believing and looking unto me, then you are guided by me. Now I say, this day that I, the living God, do know where it is that men and women are living, and I say, it is far from me. But I say that the ones who are trusting, believing, and looking unto me, of course they are guided forth in my way. And yes, they are given the strength, the truth, the blessedness, the hope, and the peace of who I am. For I say that I, the living God, will not cease to give all that my people have need of day by day. And I say that I will not cease to bring them forth, that they can indeed be found rejoicing in me. Now I say this day when I, the living God, do tell you to believe upon me, that is exactly what you are meant to do. That is, you are meant to focus your mind, your heart upon me, and do not give way to the ranting, the raging of the beast within and without. And I say you are meant to realize that it is me, the living God, who will direct you each day and guide you forth. And I say you are meant to realize that it is me, the living God, who does instruct you in the truth, the light, the strength, the blessedness of who I am. Now I say, therefore, this day continue as a steadfast people who are ever hoping, believing, and looking unto me day by day. And I say, continue in the way of my righteousness revealed, for I am indeed well able. For I say, it is me, the living God, who will give you the truth and the light upon the path, the mercy, the strength, and the hope day by day. And it is me, the living God, who will show you that through me you are guided forth, for I am well able. 
Now I say this day when I call my people to be faithful, I say that you do not know what that all entails. That is, in the sense that you remain ever standing, declaring and believing in me. For I say, when you will walk in humility, the repentant way that I provide, then I say that you can be true to me. But I say, when any will give way to pride, I say they give way to deception. I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to give way to deception, but I say that I call you to walk in the truth. And yes, I call you to be thankful each day that you can believe upon me. For I say to me, you are guided, directed, and instructed each day. And I say to me, you are given the hope and the truth, for I am well able. Now I say this day when I, the living God, do offer unto you the truth and the light, and you will walk in the same, then I say you are found abiding in me. But I say, when you go in the way of the stubborn, the foolish, the proud, I say, you are going in a way that I never ordained. And I say, when you are choosing the way that the world would offer, you are choosing the way of deceit. But I say, if you remain faithful and true unto me, you are guided forth by a plain path, for I, the living God, will cause it to be so. Now I say, this day, why not be glad that you can continue to trust, to believe, to look to me, for I am well able. And I say, why not be glad that it is me, the living God, who will ever guide, direct, and instruct you in the way of my life day by day. For I say, when you will be believing and trusting, when you will be partaking, when you will be thankful, then I say you are uplifted in that which I give time and again. For I say, it is me, the living God, who is ever faithful to give to the ones who serve me the way wherein they can be kept and guided each day. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to live under the shadow of Egypt, whereby you fear the power of Egypt more than me. But I say that I call you to live under me, for I am the one who will cover you in my wings. That is, it is me, the living God, who is the high tower of safety. It is me, the living God, who will keep you. And it is me, the living God, who will guide you forth. And it is me, the living God, who will give you the strength if you continue believing in me. Now I say this day that I, the living God, will turn the fear of the fearful against them. Therefore I say, do not, absolutely do not partake of fear. And I say, when you see the evildoers who are attempting to manipulate through fear, know that I, the living God, can turn the fear on them. That is, I can return unto them the very factor, the very power they thought they had against my own. For I say, when my people will keep trusting in me, keep up the shield of faith, and refuse to receive the fiery darts of the wicked, then I say that my people are stayed in me. Now I say this day, when you look upon what it is that I give, where it is that I lead, I say, be thankful unto me. For I say that I will lead you forth, I will direct you and instruct you in life. And yes, I will give you the mercy, the truth, and the light day by day. And yes, I will show you that I am indeed the one true God who is able to those who are believing in me. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to cave in when men would make their threats against you, but I say that I call you to crawl into me. That is, in the sense that you hide yourselves in me, not giving way to those accusations, to those lies, to those threats of the wicked against thee. But I say that I call you to realize that I am the one who is able to keep my own. And I say that I call you to realize that I am the one who will direct, correct, and guide you forth. Now I say this day in a wayward, a vile, a evil generation, let it be me that you serve each day in gratitude. That is, ever thankful that it is me you can look to, believe in, and trust. And I say, be knowing that through me you are directed in that which I give time and again. And I say, be knowing that through me you are instructed, for I will guide you forth. I say, this day do not live in fear and trembling, but I say, be living in faith and confidence in me. For I say, it is me, the living God, who will keep the ones who trust, believe, and hope in me. And it is me, the living God, who will guide forth the people who are ever subjecting themselves to my rule. For I say that my rule is righteousness revealed, and I say that I will bring forth the people who are ever able to trust in me. Now I say this day, consider that I, the living God, will uplift you, guide you, and direct you day by day. And I say, consider likewise that I will give unto you all that you need. For I say, when you look to me as the author and the finisher, when you look to me as the beginning and the end, I say that I am the one who is able. Therefore I say, do not, absolutely do not give way to fear. 
that is, the fear of men, the fear of the threats of the wicked, the fear of the beast system. But I say, give way to confidence in me. For I say, it is me, the living God, who is the high tower. It is me, the living God, who is able. Now I say, this day you are living in times when multitudes have turned from me to embrace the very beast that will devour their souls. They think all the while they are all right in the same, but I say it is not true. For I say it is me, the living God, who will guide forth the people who keep their trust in me. Now I say this day, let it be me that you believe, let it be me that you obey, and let it be me that you will follow after, for I will bring you forth. And I say that I will give unto you such as you have need of in every circumstance. And I say that I will give unto you such as you have need of, for I am well able. Now I say, why not be glad to believe, to receive, and be uplifted in me, the one true God who is able to guide you forth. And I say, why not be thankful that through me you are given all that you need, for I provide for my own. I say this day, why not be rejoicing that I am the one who is your source? And I say this day, why not be rejoicing that I am the truth, the light, and the mercy provided? For I say it is me, the living God, who is able. It is me, the living God, who will ever guide and direct. And it is me, the living God, who will give to you the truth and the light upon the path. I say this day that I, the living God, am the one who will give to you the light, the truth, and the mercy each and every day. Therefore, I say you do not lack for any good thing. For I say, what is better than to have your confidence in me? And I say, what better assurance can you have than to know that I, the living God, do keep you, for you are mine? I say this day that the systems of men shall pass away, but I say that my kingdom remains. Therefore I say, no, you are citizens of the higher kingdom, the kingdom that remains forever. That is, as long as you remain trusting in me, repenting before me, and walking in humility, then I say that your citizenship is in me. But I say, when you look to the vanity, the vexation, the pride of the world, you are looking to deceive. I say this day, do not be amongst the deceived, but I say, be amongst the wise who are ever trusting, believing, and looking to me. For I say, it is me you are meant to trust and obey. It is me you are meant to be guided and instructed by. For I say, it is me, the living God, who is truth and light, mercy, strength, and hope. Believe, believe, believe upon me. For I say, if you keep believing, if you keep trusting, if you keep hoping, then I say, you are brought forth in me. And yes, you are given the strength and the light upon the path. I say, be glad for the privilege to trust, to believe, to obey me each and every day. For I say, it is me, the living God, who desires that you would come forth, tested and tried and confident in me. I say, do not quibble within yourself over what it is that I take you through, but I say, be thankful that I am with you. Now I say, if you really consider that I go before you, that I come behind you, why should you fear in any circumstance? For I say, it is me, the living God, who is able to direct, correct, and guide you forth in that which I give you time and again. And it is me, the living God, who will give to you all that you need, for I am the one who is strength and mercy, hope, and peace provided.